This is a demonstration of the use of what we call a camel clamp, which is a piece of 11 gauge steel bent in a U shape that has square holes on either end. It's called a camel clamp because it's got raised ends on both sides and a gully in the middle. The raised ends are to accommodate a square mass pole. The gully is to accommodate a round mass pole as we're doing here. We use the camel clamps underneath the plate to add rigidity and strength because a lot of installers face the plate bending with as little as 10 to 15 pounds of torque applied to a uh, normally used U-bolt. But we're gonna, we're not using U-bolts, we're gonna use carriage bolts with these camel clamps because a carriage bolt uh, with, with the uh, maximum amount of torque that we'll use here, which is 50 foot-pounds, using a torque nut, we'll be able to maximize the tension on the carriage bolt. With U-bolts, you cannot determine the tension on either side because the U-bolt is one piece of continuous steel threaded on each end and it doesn't measure tension. So these, U -bolt, uh, these carriage bolts will measure the tension at 50 foot-pounds, which uh, with a standard hot dip galvanized carriage bolt is 12,000 pounds. Uh, using the clamp underneath, uh, it kind of ties it all together because the square ends fit in the square holes of the clamp. We don't need to use a wrench or hardware on the base. We just have to concentrate on the top of the plate where we're putting the torque nuts. So we're adding a lock washer and a flat washer. And um, on, all, on most critical connections, it is imperative that tension be uh, maximized. So these torque nuts can be used on a whole host of other critical connections that you'll find on cell towers. So now we're gonna use a regular standard uh, impact wrench with a three quarter inch socket, and we're gonna snug these nuts down and then we're gonna shear them off. And after these nuts have been sheared off, from uh, a distance, you'll be able to inspect this connection, this critical connection of this plate and see that it's been properly torqued. Um, it adds strength, efficiency, and more importantly, it adds safety to this critical connection if other, um, if wind events or if a installer has to tie himself off on, on the frame, there's no chance of it shifting and it'll make his job much safer and the whole job much safer. If you have any questions, you can contact Mark Calloway or Keith Askew at torquenut.com, T-O-R-Q-N-U-T.com.